So multiplying polynomials. And basically what we're doing when we're multiplying polynomials is expanding a term to a power or even sometimes just a term times a term. You know that when you have x minus 3 squared, what you're really doing is x minus 3 times x minus 3. And the word I'm sure you've heard at some point in your math career is FOIL, okay? First, outer, inner, last. And that's fine for sort of the principle about, behind what's going on. But what I want to do is just break that down a little bit more and basically show you that what you're really doing is taking each term in your first polynomial, in this case it's a binomial because there's two terms, and multiplying it by every term in the other one as well. So when you're doing, what you're really doing is the x times 3 and the x times x, and you're also taking the negative 3 times x and the negative 3 times negative 3 as well. Okay? So you're really taking this x and multiplying it by everything over here, and this term here and multiplying it by everything as well. When you're dealing with binomials, when you're dealing with a, something with two terms, foiling works. Okay? But as we go forward, and you're not always going to be dealing with just 2 and 2, foil, the word it won't hold, but the principle still will. Okay? So let's finish this out. We have x times x, which is just going to be x squared, negative 3 times x, negative 3 times x, and negative 3 times negative 3. Combining like terms, what we actually end up with then is x squared minus 6x plus 9. So expanding a polynomial to, times a polynomial, this tape problem is just a binomial expansion, something with two terms. FOIL is the word you know. But remember that FOIL is actually just standing for the principle of taking each term in one polynomial and multiplying it by every other term in the other.